Hey there, folks. Before we get to the episode proper, got to do the uh, Kappa thing again. Uh... Fuck it. I'm running out of creative ways of doing this, so I'm just gonna say... Look a nasty tape, Susan Wojcicki. And you know what? Same thing to all those pearl-clutching parents that are the reason that I now have to do this at the beginning of every episode. Maybe instead of complaining to the government to mo Maybe instead of complaining to the government, you actually be a parent and monitor what your child is watching online. Hey there, folks. First, you can start. My name is Rick with a pen. And this is Black Sad Under the Skin. Now, uh. Real quick, uh, I thought it might be funny to uh, tell you guys what my background uh, with this uh, game, or with this uh, series, because this is actually based on a comic book series. And that background is. absolutely fucking nothing! Uh, I only know of the existence, I only know of the existence of Black Sad previous to this game becoming a thing, because apparently it's a favorite of a friend of mine. Uh, I mean, I, it's, it's Katrina from Red Buster Gaming. It, yeah. She really likes, uh, the comic book series Black Sad. And other than the fact that it's animal peoples, I know next to fucking nothing. Show. Let's get into it. I, I have been told, however, that I don't really need to know anything about the series to, uh, to really get uh, what's going on. Scream? A scream? Okay, yeah, no, I guess it, uh, I guess it was... But uh, you fucking passed! You passed a dead body on the way in! You can't fucking... In it, this interactive drama uses similar controls to other games of its genre. Telltale <laughs> games! What? Hmm? Who, who said that, huh? Who, who said that? Sure. <laughs> Black said looks annoyed at me that I, uh want to bother with the tutorial. It's like, are you fucking kidding me, man? You literally just... Oh, that's... That... You know, that's... Oh, shit. That rocket up real quick. Um, I was about to make a joke that uh, it's both a good thing and a bad thing that they put the actual percentage of how much is loading in the corner. Now, it might actually be a bad thing because... Okay, there we go. Or not. Are you fucking loaded or not? Hello, McFly. There we go. John Plexad. Sometimes when I walk into my office, I get the feeling that I'm walking among the ruins of a lost civilization. Not because of the reigning disorder. Uh, let me... Your Blacksad? 
Is this like the decision? Oh. Oh, that's neat. Cool. I got stats. That's neat. Uh, I wasn't, I wasn't really looking for, I, oh dear, seizure warning. Uh, this screen can control sound on it, okay. Okay, I don't know what the fuck that was about. Just want to turn it on the goddamn. There we go. No, don't don't discard the changes. I. No. Fuck you. Apply changes button. I hate that shit. Just fucking apply the changes. I've been playing fucking Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3 on my Switch recently. If I had the if I had the equipment to record it, I would, okay? For all the those of you going, "Well, why the fuck?" Because I can't. Because it doesn't because they didn't put it on the fucking PS3. But, you know, there are these crystals that you can equip to your characters. Um, and I usually equip those when I'm starting up a, uh, uh, a thing to sort of level up my characters. But because I did it in the level and not, it's, it's annoying, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop before I fucking blow a blood vessel. But because it feels like the remains of the civilized person I used to be. Where is the damn detective? Ooh, here we go. I swear I'll tear his eyes out. Hey! Hand over the pictures, you bastard. Now! Otherwise, you're gonna be dead meat. Hear me, cat? Racism? Question mark? Talking with other characters, you get to choose between your... Okay. What pictures? Uh, what kind of pictures are you looking for exactly? You know which ones. Me and the lady. Two days ago. Ah. Curious, are you? Plenty of things you could learn through. I'm gonna kid! I've made a mistake. Oh, that's neat. Uh, probably not a great idea to headbutt a rhino. It wasn't my first time regretting being a guy like him. Why would you punch him in the nose? Groin! Suck on typewriter! Well, I feel fucking awesome. Oh, man. Shh. fuck out of here! Oh man, you broke my jaw. Well, now it matches your marriage. If you show my wife those pictures, I'm dead meat. You'll ruin my life. Please. First you try to kill me, then you beg for mercy. Sure, the gun didn't work. So why not shed some tears? I wasn't gonna use it, man. I've never shot a fly. And I'm no two-timer, either. It only happened once, for God's sake. I'm just her bodyguard, that's all. She seduced me. I love my wife, honest to God. I, I even quit the damn job for her. You can't break up a family for one tiny mistake. Uh... You 
fuck up your family, not me. It's my job. It's not right. It's just not right. Uh, I'm gonna go with it's just not right. That just wouldn't be ethical, would it? If I hide the truth, I deny her her freedom of will, her right to choose. Okay, how about this? You give me those pictures, and tell her a white lie, and I pay you ten times what she's offering. You save my family, and you make a pretty penny. What do you say? Deal? For as long as I could remember, I had collected nothing more than bad gigs, debt, and sorrow. My self-respect and bank account were racing to see who'd hit rock bottom first. There was more than money at stake. The man seemed honest. The best I could do for his wife was to hide the truth, no matter how low it made me feel. All right. I'll tell your wife you're clean. Get the hell out of here before I... Decision notifications. Uh, when you make a decision that has a major influence on the course of events, the notification will pop up. I regret it, pal. I made a mistake Three. bothering My with the God. tutorial, didn't I? Two. You're a good man, Blackside. One. You won't regret helping out Eugene Colbert. I promise you that. My uninvited guest had left me several gifts. First of all, a swollen hand. Why did you put your rhino in the nose? Rocks. That's your own Second fault. Of all, an empty wallet. Business as usual. Third, I was starting to second guess the morality of my last choice. Last but not least, the certainty that more gifts were yet to come. Oh, for fuck. He's a nice guy. You're right. Mm. <sighs> you see what I said about my pal Black Sad? Doesn't even know you, and he's already offering you a seat. Hmm. <laughs> yes, Jake's. Jake's right, of course. That's me to a T. Please, have a seat. I really expected more of a listen. baritone out All of Black right. Sad. I brought you a client. Which is a statement that's going to make me sound like a complete idiot if he speaks at any moment during the trailer. He speaks during the trailer, doesn't he? Mm. The sound glitch? Uh, no, I guess it's just a. Fucking hell, how long is this story? And that's why we need to find him soon, or we, we will have a very serious problem. Mm. Thanks for the information and the picture. They'll really come in handy. Let me see if I have this straight. Fucking orangutans, man. Orangutans are like one of the weirdest looking animals. I mean, let's be honest, it looks like their face is coming out of a butt. Of course, frankly, I'm sure that if I actually had a face cam, people would be saying that about me, too. <clears throat> anyway. So, from the looks of it, the guy that was swinging from the rafters in the first part Your might have been father, this cat Joe guy. Dunn, boxing manager and gym owner, hanged himself two days ago. Yes. 
Bobby Yale, a boxer at Dunn's gym, has a crucial fight against the reigning champion in two weeks. But he disappeared two days ago, right about the same time your father died. Yes. In short, if Bobby Yale is a no-show for his fight, you'll have to pay a fine. But since you don't have the cash on hand, your father's gym would have to close. Yes. So you want me to find Bobby Yale? Yes. No. Jake wants you to find Bobby. Oh. Oh. I see. Okay. Well, first of all. Uh. Your father took his life the same day his pupil disappeared. Sorry. But something just doesn't add up. Damn it, John. Will you take the case or not? Sure. Yeah. I know the money is tight, so uh, how about this? If I solve the case, we'll see how much you can pay. I'm sure we'll find a suitable price. Okay. Of course, given the style of or the genre that uh, Black Set seems to em emulate, emulate, emulate. Yeah, emulate. Um, there's probably a good chance I'm never gonna see hiding her hair that money. Not a fucking bit. What am I getting paid for my last job, anyway? Like, just cause... Okay. So, I said I wouldn't tell the wife... ...about when the husband cheated. But that doesn't mean I don't get paid. Right? Because I still followed the husband. I would just be telling her that I didn't find anything. Also, I really hope I don't end up regretting that. Secret champions. Nothing, but I'll search it myself at some point. I uh, love that kind of advertising. The advertising you know but is anyway, full of shit. Miriam Purnell, the one who found Joe Dunn's body. She works part time at Sam's Diner, just down the road on the left, right? That's right. Uh, I think I might uh, pay her a visit as well, and the gym, of course, and see what I can find. Okay, I think I've got enough to start with for now. Does he kind of sound like, uh... Christopher Walken to anyone else? And one of his more... Like... If Christopher Walken had the capacity to be subtle. Neat. Is that done? Wow. For the love of... Would you just let... I get how to do... Okay.
Well, that oh mother. Bribe, nope, but I'll tell my wife you're clean. Jake, Sonia, Joe, Bobby, Al, and Mary. Does does Al have a, uh, do you have a cigar in this picture, or is that just, like, his neck, and it's just sort of a weird angle for a picture? I think it's his neck, it's just a weird angle in the picture. <sighs> what the f- Okay. Right then. Can I make any deductions right now? You need to gather enough clues. Well, that was fucking pointless. And did the game just crash? There we go. I'm aware of how a pause menu works, you... Now let's see if I can take three steps without a fucking tutorial popping up again. Weren't there more... Choices last time I looked at that. Eh, fuck it. Oh, hmm. That Someone looks like should a weld the iron bar on those panels. Okay. Yes, that's what I was trying to look at. Stop fucking looking at it, Black Sab. <clears throat> no, not that stupid built board. Yeah, great. Hmm. There we go. Oh, picture. The fuck? There's a Hall of Fame sports cart. Oh. Okay. Sure. Collectibles. In collection, you can choose to open the album so the card's placed in its slot. All right. Sure. Watch this be the thing that crashes the game. I'm just waiting for it at this point. Yeah. Oh, that's... that's actually kind of interesting. That the collection page is, uh... Interesting little, uh, format we got here. Got all kinds of sports as well. Football, baseball, bassin, high. Uh, that's it. <laughs> That's it. 
Of course, then again, this is supposed to be like set in like the 50s or something. How many was I really expecting? We Americans, we only knew about four types of uh, sports. to spy on Sonia. Well, Black said, could you have said that in a creepier way? Like, I get it. You're a private investigator. Still the creepiest way you could have said that. Okay, I should probably wrap this up set up here. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please consider- can I get you to look at the screen, Black Set? There we go. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Please consider like, commenting, subscribing, sharing, and dinging the bell. And hopefully I'll see you guys next time. Mmm, bye. Oh, also, sorry this is late. But, um... I got caught up doing stuff yesterday, and when I eventually started downloading Black Sad, it, uh, took a fucking while. What the f-